Hi guys, in this video I want to show you how you can make a quick fix for the network adapter on Kali Nilox um, of this alpha. Uh, as you know, people who recently has bought uh, this network adapter, the cheapest that it work well on Kali Linux. And it is actually the monitoring and the injection doesn't work. Doesn't matter what driver you download. So I have found some fix and I want to show you how you can do that and then it is might work. So let's get started. First, before we get started, you have to make sure on your Kali Linux, um, you this here on USB, you make you have to make sure that you use USB 3 and you mark this uh, network adapter. And if you didn't do it, then just connect it. Of course, turn off the machine, connect it and do add the new filter and you choose uh, the network adapter. And then you can start. So let's get started. So first, if I will try to connect my uh, network adapter right now, it is won't work. It is even will not recognize uh, the network adapter. So we're gonna try a few things. So first, let's just create some, uh, I don't know, some directory. Let's, let's go to wireless, wireless, and let's go to it. And the next, um, the next thing we, I'm gonna do is we're gonna download the driver Shanghan where is it yeah we're gonna download it of course I will I will post all the commands we're gonna make on this video and you will see let's stop I will stop this video because it takes some time um, and I will start again okay we have downloaded it so now um before i met stale before all the commands we're gonna do right now doesn't matter all this process you have to unplug your network that your network card the alpha one so the next step we're gonna download or i will post it we need to download this file this file from here let's just copy it uh, pretty much quick as you can see Let's copy it zero to your directory. Right, we copy it. So let's go to let's clear it. So it is the text file we have downloaded here. This is the the directory of the driver we have downloaded. And now we're gonna do after we download it, we're gonna paste this command. Let's do it sudo. Put your network we could yes, and we do it over again. As you can see, patching uh, the file, which is great. So the next um, the next step we're gonna open the sudo nano. You can try gedit or vm, whatever you like. And we're gonna edit the make file over here. I want better is she edit sudo g edit make file. Okay, so the first step we're gonna to line 26 over here, and we're gonna to change it to y. The next it is will be line hang on line wind eight one line white yes this is a one eight one we're gonna change it to y also and the last line is 460 460 and we are here and we do not do uncomment that and you're gonna do save for that save and now the next step let's uh, clear now we'll do sudo make this is the next step it is will take a while so get some co copy i will pause the video and we'll start again when it's finished okay it is done and now the next step we're gonna use do 
sudo make install and it is gonna be pretty much quick and now the next step we need to reboot do sudo reboot and I will come back to you when the machine will restart again okay so we come back after the reboot and let me plug it in the virtual the network adapter sorry activated it sometimes it's gonna show you here and then you can get this error oh all right this works now we can see the wi-fi here don't turn it on let's uh, make the following commands it's gonna be first sudo ip link great and let's turn it on to monitor mode now oh okay so if you get rf kill so it is might happen because the wi-fi so you can do this command so do rf kill unblock wi-fi and now we just want to unblock it and so do i have config will up so the wi-fi off it is important because then you can do injection if it is on and now the next move we need to make one more thing we need to set up the tx power in a second this is the command and set the export off it's clear i have double config we can see it is on monitor mode i have dev we can see here it is tx power and it's nice so let's try to run um some monitoring so it's gonna be sudo error dump w0 let's see if we get anything it is might not work it is might not work because we need to do um sudo reboot again while the network card is plugged in but we just try now luck we can see it is not works right now and it is okay so the next step is after we seek the network is plugging in we're gonna do sudo reboot again and let's see okay so we came back after the reboot as you can see i didn't do anything it is here and the wi-fi as you can see over here w config sorry config yes we are here let's try this to the error dump of course not because we are not a monitor let's set it up again so we're gonna try this command is always better down and monitor and sudo fconfig up again it is rf rf kill turn on yes up as you can see over here and tx power don't forget that then dev sudo error dump zero and as you can see now we have the monitoring which is great you can do now everything let me show you just one more command before i will do that just for example let's take i don't know let's close it and let's try do authentication attack or some random one uh, uh, let's take this guy right oh sorry if it's zero okay it's not in channel so let's try just change sudo let's 
to do a config if you need to, to change the channel we are zero channel um, in this case we need the 10 it is my access point and let's try to try the authentication attack as you can see inject injection also working you can do anything right now you can capture uh, pickup files you can use a uh, fake access point you can sniffing you can try everything you want in wireshark and try better cap you can try any tool it is will work and don't forget to um, keep it off and to use usb3 as i show you before and that's it actually this might work next time plug in again and try um if it doesn't work if monitoring doesn't work reboot again while the network card is plugging in and that's it uh, thank you for watching my video and please subscribe that's it <laughs>